Yo, what's up guys, today we are going to be playing some uh, Castle Hero Survival <clears throat> And I know that the host is very very good player At least I remember him to be such Because I used to play this map like probably a year ago or something And uh, I remember the guy, I feel like he won against me or he was like, you know, kind of decent So I'm gonna give it my best strat So this is my strongest probably I hope it's still like uh, up to date Strat in Custom Hero Survival. Where is the Tinker? For the research buildings, you basically have like uh, zero, and for the production buildings, you have nine. And that's how I play. I know it's pretty comfortable. I need to make a research, I press zero. I need to select my hero squad, I press one. I need to like produce units, I click on nine. So, yeah. We need more coal. Yeah, I feel like this game gonna be sweaty. Quite, quite sweaty. Oh, this guy already had a mid touch. I'm not entirely sure whether starting with the middle touch is better, to be honest or not. Um, the goal difference is around 700 gold. Oh no, I fucked up. I literally fucked up right now. I cast a transmute too early for no reason. <laughs> You have to cast it on a dying unit. Ah, eh, whatever, it's fine. Yeah, I like when I, whenever I come back to certain maps, I completely forgot like your, you know, sequence of actions. So yeah, if you learn transmit first, you win. Then I guess like around seven hundred gold. But you're gonna lose uh, the ancient teaching. So. I'm not sure if it's better or not, honestly. Because I wanna keep ancient teaching. I mean, yeah, it's 100 gold better, I guess. Yeah, so me, the statue is more profitable. I mean, I, you actually win 525 gold. No, 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 it's not profitable. But then you have earlier golden rings, I guess. So it kinda escalates. I'm really thinking whether the difference in the sequence of spells is important or not. But then you don't need to relearn like ancient teaching immediately, and you can go for the pillage first. Ah. Yeah. So many questions, you know. I hope they don't show wave. Do this shock wave is nuts. What the hell was that shockwave? Bruff. Yeah, I feel, I feel like I had to, to get transmit first. Uh, so it's transmit first and ancient teaching later. Because you can then not get ancient teaching immediately and wait a little bit. It was a floatsy. So we failed slightly, but... You know, I learned a little bit, right? So, yeah. I still have my strat. So maybe my strat is going to work uh, nicely. That's what I hope for. God, they're evasive. Very, very evasive, these guys are. Yeah, so as a result, 
I'm just, I'm very curious, like, how much is gonna be the goal difference between me and this guy. It should be, like, uh, around 1000. If it's anything above 1000, then, yeah, we really messed up. We really, really messed up. You know what, I feel like the goal difference is not that big indeed. Ah, uh, we lose against him. His hero is better for early games, so... Not much we can do about that. I mean, I can still try, but... Yeah. Ah, oh god, his evasion is cancer, yeah. I'm such a late, 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 late game hero. That's fine. I like the challenge. So, this red guy is playing pretty well, so, yeah. You know. I will very like me some challenge. Thinking about my build, though. Thinking about my build. How do I see it myself? <clears throat> hmm. I'm gonna struggle against the creeps. Oh, I can tell like, I will struggle against the creeps. Um, so I can't go for the pillage straight away, right? Maybe I get my entire skill set first and then go for the pillage. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna do that. Ah, uh, screw that. Okay, so we need Air Force, we need the Cyclone, we need a uh, Multicast, we need a. Uh, Mysterious Talent? What is Mysterious Talent? Mysterious Talent? Um... Multicast, blah blah blah... Um... Just last breath... Last breath... Eh... Eh... God damn it. I'm not entirely sure what now. I gotta be blizzard and pillage. And probably a slot left. Maybe get and snare straight away. for now, until I'm more decisive. Yeah, yeah, that's actually it. That's actually it. I feel like I'm pretty sure this is the build then. So, now we get the blizzard. The blizzard. And then the pillage. I really hope we're gonna survive. I actually have no idea which one of these spells is gonna be on my C. Cyclone or Blizzard? But okay. Red is not going for the pillage, he's rather abusing the Midas touch. So he applies Midas touch to all the creeps. Around himself. Huh, alright. AK transmuting everyone around himself. Yeah, this guy has a good strat, it seems. We're gonna be struggling. Yeah, 
Yeah, we're gonna be hella struggling, I guess. Because he's doing some 500 IQ strat, it seems to me. With his uh, Midas touch of his. Other people... I feel like other people like... Uh, try harding too much, as it seems. Um, yeah, by the way, we have to sack uh, probably the second PvP completely. This guy has level 12 pillage, this guy has level pillage level 10, 22. Interesting, yeah. I feel like it's mostly red. Like, the, the red is the guy who is uh, like a big tryhard. Everyone else is a bit less of that. Yeah, I, I have no chance of winning the next PvP yet, so... <laughs> but it's fine. My build is super late game. Because I will be able to remove all of these spells. Like this one, this one, and the last one. And I don't need to pay for it like 20k. So I'm I'm trying to giga brain my build quite a lot. Yo, what's up, Konda? I think it's a good strat. You just play the race you like on the single player first, like a few times, and it's gonna be way easier to play when you know what to do at the start, etc. Yeah, indeed. Uh, practicing your strat in single player is a valuable thing, you know, like... a valuable strat. Impale 16. <laughs> this guy has. Chaos magic, random spells. Yeah, tranquility. Alright. Yeah, rough times. Can't can beat these um, early game heroes. If they are early builds. Yeah, we need to finish uh, maxing out the pillage and we are Gucci. Alright, nice, 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 nice. Now we increase the block. Uh, we get the arena rings. And we level up Blizzard more. Just to be safe, probably to level 6. Range, Hero Boulder, Polarize. That's a bit disgusting. Alright, so now we're gonna go for um, Income. Okay, my last boss is gonna be bl uh, Blink. Not so sure what what else. Red died to creeps. <laughs> All right. Yeah, that's that was unexpected. How much HP they have? One k. Um, just a bit more blizzard. Yeah. I'm kinda scared, not gonna lie. Yeah, so going for income, income, income. Is there anyone like who is going for income too? Green is going for income, okay. Purple? Zero income. Green, 450. Orange, zero. Red, zero for now. Yeah, I don't understand, like, so his staff casts all single target spells up to 10 nearby targets. When they are cast, each additional target costs 60% of initial mana cost, and fails if the hero doesn't have enough mana. I guess, like, Midas Tash requires you a lot of mana, because I don't understand, like, why does he... Why is he stacking mana so much? Otherwise, you know what I mean? Like, isn't that a bit excessive? But, okay. I 
Ideally, I max out uh, Blizzard and then I'm gonna win the PvP. Next PvP, most likely. Most likely, so. Yeah, I kinda need it. You know, I kinda need it, so. Yep, max it out. And now for the items, I can get something cool. Like uh, boots, boots are great. Lots of angst of reincarnation. Does anyone has like target spells, like in Tango, Stormbolt? Well, there is one Impale. I don't know if you can dodge Impale with the spell block, but I'm gonna try. So now we have maxed out Blizzard, and what's his hero ability? Uh, his hero ability is. He gets extra levels for all the spells in Active Shop 1. So Active Shop 1 is this. So if he would have one level of any of his spells, he gets like extra levels for free, basically. Plus he also in uh, gets extra rune power. Yeah. Oh my god, this guy is kind of strong. Yeah, what the fuck are your skeletons, mate? <clears throat> I guess that's how it works. Otherwise, I have no idea, to be honest. I have zero clue. <laughs> um, yeah, so now I have to get better items, but I have no idea which ones to get. Yeah, this guy has insane HP regeneration and a lot of damage reduction. Alright. He casted Acid Bomb on me. But I had Rune Braces, so... That's what happened. Now we increase uh, Holy Enlightenment whenever we can. Again, not, not whenever I can, because I already maxed it out. Um... I'm gonna get a lot of armor from having agility, and I'm gonna have a lot of agility, so... Um, I don't think I need to buy armor then, right? Yeah, I don't feel like I need to buy armor. What do I do with my glory? <laughs> I can already buff my movement speed to max, so I don't need boots, I guess. No fun allowed build. True, but hey, listen. I know Red is good, and he's trying some very good strat. I like his strat; it's creative. So uh, I, I, it's only like you know, a matter of respect for me to pull out my strongest build and my biggest gun. I'm gonna show him my biggest gun. This build that I'm playing right now is my biggest like arsenal gun. I can't play better than that. I mean, unless I'm, I practice a bit, because I don't remember how to play my build, but the concept, the concept is my best, yeah. It's PvP, so I'm not gonna increase income yet. And instead, yeah, save up cash. I need to buff my magic damage now, as much as I can. I'm thinking how to do it properly. Maybe these. Maybe these. Hmm. I I changed my mind. Um. 
I can't have it anyway. Yeah, I'm missing just like 402 gold. That's very unfortunate. Yeah, this guy with the skeletons is uh, pretty fancy. <laughs> Ah, whatever, I'm not gonna have spell block. I, I feel like I don't need spell block when you have uh, anti-magic shell. Anti-magic flag, so, yeah. I think you read my question so fast. Oh, this, was this your... was this build your idea? I thought you asked... What's the idea of the build? Yeah. <laughs> okay, dude. Uh, yes. I feel like it was, like I've seen Air Force on someone, and then I kind of like started playing around it, and I realized there is thing called uh, Cyclone, and it exists, you know, and it's, it goes very well with the Air Force and Stampede. I should play Tinker. Uh, 20k gold income. I feel like post level 30 I'm gonna reskill myself. Maybe not. I'm, I'm trying to figure out whether I need gold or XP. Gold or XP. It's kind of hard. Mm. Okay, I, I won the lottery. I feel like this guy is the weaker one. Nice. Alright, good. Good. Alright, this is uh, becoming scary. <laughs> this is becoming quite scary. <laughs> you know what? Okay. I think it's time. I think it's time for me to drop the pillage. And stop increasing income too. Yeah, 26k gold probably should be enough, and I now prioritize the experience. Alright. Alright, and now we're gonna keep buying wounds of memories that give gonna give me bonus experience while yeah so basically I sacrifice all the experience I had but now I have 77 in agility per level 77 agility per level boys Okay, now we have 105 agility per level. <laughs> I 
All right. Good. 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 Um. Yeah. So PVP happens now. Ugh. Is there a way for me to win this without trying too hard? Just you know, just a little bit, but not too much. Just like that, maybe. I could also level up Air Force slightly. Ever slow, so slightly? No. Should I level up Air Force? I'm gonna sacrifice gold. I don't believe in this item, so let's use all the gold except for that. Okay then, guess like this, and I guess like that. Oh, this guy is uh, pretty damn strong. I don't think I can pierce through him, to be frank. Doesn't seem to be the case, so... Hmm. Yeah. How much block do you have, mate? Nice. Yeah, so he limits the damage to himself, to 20% of his max HP. But my Cyclone hits like so often, and I'm already starting to level up Air Force. So my Air Force right now is applying 35 agility of mine uh, to any damage. So it applied to Cyclone, Cyclone got multicasted. Oh, I forgot about uh, the, the thing, uh, the, the Book of Zazil. Oh my god, yeah. That's what I forgot about. God damn it. Yeah, it's whatever, it's fine. Okay. The Book of Zazil gives you a chance to reset a spell. So you cast a spell, you can get a, you know, a recast on it. I like this lobby, I feel like they understand my build and they know what's going on, I guess. Which is... admirable. Let's get it just a little bit more. I want to have... ...50k agility. Is 50k agility greedy? Or not? I have no idea. But yes, I want... ...50k agility. At least that's how I believe it is, no? My XP is better because stats in this case are related to my level, so yeah. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna let him level up. It's level 40, I'm not leveling up. And I, I wanted to level up at least 100 times. So, dude. I mean, we really need to level up now. <laughs> we really do. Uh, which item should I go for? I like that. Getting myself some magic protection.
should I? Maybe I should go for the glass cannon build for now, for this PvPs. Red just left. <laughs> Why? Dude, like, I was looking forward to fight him because he seemed like a strong player. But now he just rage quitted. Eh? Nah, I'm gonna buy a bit of HP. Just a little bit. Not super a lot. Yeah. BG. I wanted like a bit more interesting fight, I guess. Than that. And that's what all I got. Come on, man. Bam, bam. 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 Uh, yeah, okay, so... Make your predictions, boys. Will we get 100 levels now? So the Tinker's passive is that he gains bonus experience every time he levels. So he levels, he gets bonus XP, he levels again, more bonus XP. So he's like XP grind machine. Basically. And therefore like, yeah. And for XP you can get permanent stat gain. So every time you level, you get stats. And that's what I, that's what I did. So I sacrificed a lot of experience I had, that's why I'm not leveling up. So I have 300 agility per level now. Question is, will I even level up or not? Because I don't seem to be leveling up. Join uh, Legacy's lobby after your game and check out the players. That's disgusting. I still have 9 rounds to go, so, yeah. Um, Necklace of Magic Absorption gives you 20% bonus experience from enemies killed with magic damage, which is true because I kill with Cyclone, Blizzard, and Air Force. Uh, Urn of Memories, basically, every time I kill a creep, I get twice of my level XP. So, for each urn I have, I get basically 308 XP per creep. Learn ability gives 10,000 XP for each creep. And then Holy Enlightenment gives the missing gap between the next two levels. So that that thing basically was a uh, comp yeah, this thing I sacrifice all my experience and then this thing comes back my experience, you know what I mean? So I was missing 1.2 million XP. This thing restores it by 45% every time. That's how I'm being able to get my XP back. Alright, let's go boys. Let's see how... Oh my god, I'm leveling so fast. Dude, I had 5k agility. Look at this, I have 7.6. Actually, maybe... Actually, maybe I'm gonna get my... Um... 50k agility. Damn, that's gonna be very cool. <laughs> Alright, let's max out my spells. So we have... This is like, you can cast spells twice. Um, I don't need to max out Cyclone, it's useless. I mean, spell is very good, but it's already good at level 1. Mysterious Talent lets you cast Blizzard and Cyclone on yourself. Max out and Snare. And Snare primarily I need, like, it... It goes through magic immunity, aka avatar, to pin down people so they stay in my cyclone. It's very important. And yeah, we basically max out everything. All the spells. Now all this gold gonna go to uh, absolutes. So there's like absolute wind, for example. That's gonna give me some cool things, cool things, you know. Oh boy, we are leveling, okay. So we leveled for now 31, yeah, 31 levels. And there's been like 3 rounds, right? Ugh. I guess we can level up 100 times and get 50k agility. I really hope it's gonna be the case. And then, you know what? There's an item that can give you 35% bonus stats to what you have. So I'm thinking whether it's good or not. To buff my 50k agility by getting 
extra 35% of it. It's gonna be like... How much? Uh, 17.5k. 17.5k. Uh, is it good? Extra 17.5k agility. Maybe. Actually insane lol, yeah. So, to give you the math currently, my cyclone damages 5 times of my 150% ag agility. So, my cyclone damages 5 times per second. Uh, 24k damage. 24k damage. <laughs> That's what my cyclone does. You see? And then they stack. <laughs> That's the best part about it. Nah, it's not gonna be 50k, yeah. I mean, I have 300 agility per level, after all. Only. Fuck. I feel like at best I'm gonna have, at this rate, 45, I guess. What did I want to get again? I forgot the items. I forgot what I want to buy. Fuck. Oh, Book of Zazio. Yeah, Book of Zazio. I hope this guy is thinking my damage, to be honest. Bit crazy, but okay. <laughs> the fa the fact that ensnare is like one second cooldown <laughs> is so disgusting. <laughs> yeah, but he was tanking me so well. He was capping the damage down to him to twenty percent, and then he can await any damage. With the Mask of Illusion. He has 300 evasion, and he was awaiting like literally 85% of the damage instances. Plus he had like a uh, HP regeneration, and yeah. Oh, he also has Aura of Mortality. 50% chance to dodge damage completely. Plus he has Unholy Aura. Which gives 2k HP per second. So, yeah, and when a hero attacks, its evasion increased by 300 for a short period of time. Yeah, this guy is very ev evasive. Damn. And then we have these two Andys who are like skeleton guys. <laughs> Why everyone, like, wants to be invisible so much? Yeah. Everyone is abusing this temporary invisibility. I mean, cool builds at least, yeah, like, interesting builds. 30k gold, I don't even know what to spend it on. It's gonna be absolutes plus HP, I guess. Yep. Magic protection. It's classic Satyr evasion build, everyone goes that build on Satyr low, yeah. Yeah, so basically the item allows you to dodge spells, not only attacks. Come 
Come on, come over, come over, come over. Yeah. Yeah, my prediction is gonna be that I will have uh, 35k. 35k agility. Yeah, it's not that much. I could have done way better. Could have done way, way better. Can't you buy XP? Actually, that's a good idea. Yeah, that's actually a very good idea. Wait. Wait. Because I, I mean, like, what else do I spend my gold on? I would, I was going to get HP. Fuck, w was it always just uh, getting... Wait. Why is it so cheap as well? Wait, hold on. Huh? Wait. Nick, you did something. Did something OP, man. <laughs> Hold on. Oh my god, I actually reached 550k experience. I mean 50k agility. My cyclone damages 75k damage per second. I'm gonna be low on HP though, but I will try to compensate that somehow. Defensive items and you know stuff like that. But gosh, okay, I'm gonna stop. Yeah, I'm gonna stop buying XP. Yeah, dude, it, I feel like it was it was like that all this time, this entire time. Actually buying experience. Huh. Bruv. Look at this agility. That's uh fucking insane, mate, isn't it? Um Okay, let's decide with the spouse first. Because I might not have time later on. One is gonna be blink. Blink, 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 blink. What the fuck is a blink? Blink. Good. Other one gotta be pretty sure mega luck. And then I would say the wine bubble. We're under so the wine bubble removes the stun. And like life steal. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we some items. Um Arcane Wind Arcane Light Light Let's have like three lights I guess mm, But I feel like it's not That good Just buff HP I'm a bit paranoid about my HP Yeah, now it's better Ticker Air Force gonna go crazy I gotta stay away from everyone. It's a battle royale, so... Can I blink? Blink, 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 blink. Hmm. 
We have to wait for the cyclone, boys. Your skeletons are crazy. <clears throat> Play GG, man. Uh, good game. Very skilled matchup. Hacker? No, you. Dude, <laughs> 54k agility. Ugh. That was a good one. Yeah, we scout and build though, kind of made me almost lose. Not gonna lie. Hacker comment had me be, had to be a joke. Maybe, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Alright, that was fun. GG, school game.